every year they decide that Sandstar is the perfect person to take their wedding commemorative photos. And every year they have been proven right. For have they not said practically every single time I've taken pictures that this is exactly like their wedding? This right here. Th this is their wedding. This is what it was like. Just just tables as far as the eye could see. That's that's what they had. It, it, it's how they did it. Don't believe me? We'll ask them today. Greetings, everyone. It is I, Kikoski, welcoming you to the earlier stream than normal, and the earlier pre-stream, where you have the opportunity to get here, get comfortable, get ready for day 567 of Hills Far. Hello, how are you? It is earlier because my parents are coming over, and I wanted to be done with the stream. Aren't we the only wedding photographer? Yeah, we, we are. As my stream description says, we are the best on Hillsfire. You cannot deny that this title is 100% factually correct. We are, in fact, the best photographer on the entire island. The fact that we are the only photographer on the entire island is entirely a secondary thought. Also, there's a picture of a happy Bella. Who wants to see a picture of a happy Bella? There's a happy Bella. Look, look the happy Bella. Yeah, that Bella is very happy. There is a happy X. There is a very happy X. What? It is! It is! On, on a scale of, of one to... Happy Eeks. That is a Happy Eeks. Hello MC, how you doing? I hope you're doing well. Hopefully I won't have to end the stream a little earlier. Um... But we will see, because they are apparently making really good time. Uh, making really good time. One moment. How many weddings has Sandstar photographed at Hillsfar? Uh, the same one, numerous times, I'll have you know. And we are an expert at it. We are... A veritable expert. Oh, this reminds me. I, I probably need to... There's so many little things I need to do. I don't know if they'll end up being a, uh, a stream on Thursday or Saturday. I, I don't know how my situation is going to be in that regard. Also, we are now well and truly into summer on Hillsfar. So, now villagers will start walking around with ice creams. And ice creams are like the best thing ever. I have so many amazing pictures of Tangy with an ice cream from Avataros today. It's nice. Ah, uh, it's just so nice. But yeah, I'm going to be pretty busy for a few days. It's also summer right now in the Philippines. <laughs> well, I mean, it's not summer here yet. Um, here, here's the, uh, the the fun thing about um, when summer starts. Summer starts on the 20th of June. So, you know, bit of time left. <laughs> Hello there, uh, Cav. Uh, how is your... Uh, your well, I was going to ask how your cough is, but I know how your cough is, because, um, you just coughed. I like the fact that I... my cough is just great! Uh, wouldn't you rather it went away, though? I... I think you'd rather it was gone. So, uh, as usual, have, we are the best 
wedding photographer ever. And we have been doing wedding photography things. So today we'll be doing even more wedding photography things. Now I have two amiibos that I could invite today. I could invite Cleo for the second time, and I probably will. But I have other amiibos for all the other villagers. They're all finally here. I just hope it doesn't... Actually, if it rains today, it'll be alright. But uh, it's going to be a busy day. Because my parents are going to turn up, and then I'm going to have a bunch of boxes to unpack. I have a lot of boxes to unpack. That will be exciting. And also terrifying, because they all have to fit in this room. I'm going to have to definitely make some very difficult decisions going forward. About things I own. But that is, that is for then. That, that is for them. Well, this is clearly a massive mod for Daikatana playing it. No. I think you will find that it currently says in the category Animal Crossing New Horizons. Yeah, my parents had um, had their car in to replace tires, potentially. Turns out it didn't need tires replacing, so they're setting off like an hour earlier than originally planned. So at first it was like, oh, I I'll have plenty of time to stream. But that was like, actually, no, I'm going to have uh, less time to stream. So I decided to start early, and then I realized that I might even have less time to stream. But I will still do my customary wait a few minutes. We will get stuff done. We'll be alright. Busy day. Busy week. Not just a busy day. <laughs> Kev, uh, kindly uh, tell people how not busy my weeks have been. Oh wait, every week since I have moved has been busy in some regard. If it isn't like painting walls and assembling furniture, it's dealing with tradespeople and sorting out stuff and going out and buying things and dishwashing and cleaning and DIY and it, there's, there's so much stuff. Yeah, um... <sighs> it is a thing. I, I have to do it all on my own back as well, that's the fun part. If I take days off, I, I don't... I don't get any benefit for it. It's just days where I don't work. And where days I don't get paid. So, uh, we'll see how we do. I will keep you all informed. Wednesday and Friday streams are still 100% going ahead. They are still 100% going ahead. And business will return to usual next, um, next week. But we're not on next week right now. We're on this week. And... We're going to get started. Ah, oh, my life is uh, full of excitement. The best part about it, everyone, is that I will be getting, as far as I can gather, my old Warhammer. So uh, that's going to be a fun development. Getting my old Warhammer to have a look at and uh, see what I want to do with it. Do I want to keep any of it? Do I want to harvest bits from it? Do I want to sell it? I don't know. I honestly don't know. I'll find out once I discover what's there. Also, there's coal. Being coal! I'm very glad that it's not going to rain today on the island. I really didn't want to deal with it raining. 
this is where like label is here. I really wanted to be CJ Flick or Sahara. Alias is going to turn up, by the way. I warned Alias. I added Alias on my Discord to warn him I was starting early. His timekeeping is going to be completely off. Hello there, everyone! Right now on Hillspot's 1.40pm on Tuesday, June the 4th, 2024. Kix is here with a fresh batch of shoes, socks and bags. Oh, that's great. If your footwear is getting thinner and you want to treat yourself to a new bag, be sure to stop by the plaza. And with that, I get back to words of money you and your enjoyment of our island. Thank you. Also, this means we get to hear some of the 1pm music for a while. How often do we hear the 1pm music? It's so rare. I like the 1pm music. It's so good. Do we have to deal with that? Yes, we do. Okay, that's not bad. That's a tremendous statue. Okay, we're just gonna hand out some uh, clams, I think, today. Apologies there, just uh, dealing with my headset. Right. Let's be quick. And still get completely taken aback by adorableness, because this is this is what always happens. We always get taken aback by adorableness. Look at this fancy music. Just gonna do this. One clam should be sufficient. And you get plus one friendship point because you wrap the present. Remember, the first villager you talk to in a day also gets a bonus friendship point. All we need to do is uh, change some of our clothes. I think we need to wear something very snazzy, something only a wedding planner would, would wear. Only something a wedding planner would wear. All right, I have the perfect outfit in mind, okay? The perfect outfit. Just need to find the right... Uh... There we go. Start with the spangle shorts. Yeah, start off strong. Start off with spangle shorts. What else do we need apart from spangle shorts? Mm, that, that's interesting. But... Changing it a mini fridge? That, that is par for the course on Hills Far. It used to be a bigger fridge, then we condensed everything down into a smaller fridge. Hmm. Hmm. Try to find something that would go with the spangle shorts. I'm having difficulty finding something. I really am. That goes with it! Okay, okay. That goes with it. Okay, there we go. Where are those? Do I have any sparkly shoes? 
Green. Oh, a green multi coordinate. That's a good idea. That is a good idea. Coordinate with the tie. I like it. Okay. Need a backpack. Obviously a star backpack. And now I need glasses. Hmm. Yes. We are the coolest. No one can deny our, our awesome power of fashion. After all, there is that quote that never lies that states that I am passionate about fashionate. We are very passionate about our attire. And we have always been known as super trendy. Oh. Yep, yeah, see, I am passionate about being fashionate. This is true. Oh, it's been so long since I've heard this music. Do 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 do. Be, be. Do 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 do. Oh, it's so many good memories. What's important here is that you're snazzy. I mean, this is true. I am incredibly snazzy. Scientists increasingly believe that Kokoskia is in fact snazzy. This is a truth. This is a truth. Is that a villager? That's Margie! Margie with a bag! Margie! Good afternoon, Tootie. What fantastic fashion you've got here. Oh, well, really, you've got a gift for me? That I do. Would you like thing? What what's inside? A giant clam! Thanks a lot, Mike and Henny, for something I've been planning. Here, I want you to have my rice cooker. We've got one of those. It's snazzy. What do you mind, Tootie? Just want a chat. Aren't the bugs in the museum great? I love losing myself in their world. I could spend hours just watching a robust cicada. Well, off she goes. She, she's got a busy day ahead of her. Cam, by the way, is gifting that sub over to Steel Rain 55. You are one sub away from gifting 200 subs, Cav. That's more than three. That's a lot more than three. One sub. I don't know what accolade there is for getting to 200, but, but I'm sure there is one. I'm sure it will happen naturally. Like we're running around here and putting money in the Jitters Fund. We have just enough money. 53 bells left. That's all we got. 53. Unfortunately, you can't give to sub to me because I'm always sub to my own channel. Fun little fact, you're always up to your own channel. You can always use your own emotes. Time to get swole! Oh, we will get swole. I just need to uh, sort out all this. Okay. We only have about another, what, nine minutes of the uh, standard theme? for 1 p.m. Then we go back to the 2 p.m. one that we all know. Oh, there's a jitters. Go! I like those threads. Got a gift for you. Huh, what do you got, Berserk? I have got... Thing! My inventory is completely full. What's inside? It's a giant clam. Oh, this is great. 
It'll be perfect with some heavy curls, but there gotta give as much you take. Please take an abstract wall. It's abstract. Is it a wall? Is it not? I don't know. Um, what's going on, Bizzard? Just wanna say hi. Sandy! The clothes you got me are awesome! <laughs> I couldn't wait to show this off to you. How does it look? Perfect sh fit to show off my muscles, right, Bizzard? Kinda confusing to hear the other tune. I'm used to hearing the 2 p.m. one. Don't worry. The 2 p.m. one is inbound. We, we will hear the 2 p.m. one soon enough. Why am I going into here? I don't know. But what I am going to do right now is I'm going to go and get swole. Jinnis is already getting swole. Now, is he going to take part in this? The answer is... Yes! And so is Margie. And Bud. Put some pep in your movements, everyone! Here we go! Time to get swole. Look at the fact that I just have had that flag for a lot of years, that I've just kept this flag. Just kept it. It's not changed. I think it used to have eggs on it, but then we removed the eggs. And the uh, Avatar or Swamp. It's just Edna. Egg! Still like the egg emote. I like all my emotes. There are some that get more used than others, like uh, the Tingy. Tingy gets a lot of use. Watch, by the way, people at about uh, a couple minutes turning up now. And they'll already see me mid-exercise. I do. I have two dedicated tangy buttons. This is true. But one of them is the special tangy button. It makes the tangy go panic. We do not want the tangy to go panic. Yay! Yeah. I'm gonna have to organize everything in this room so much better now that I have all my old stuff come. Well, I found chops! I also found Bila! Oh! Look at the Bila! Look at the Bila! Get your happy bear laugh. Oh, Sandy! Nice to see you! I got a gift for you, Bella. For me- Oh! Taggy steak. Hey, Bella! Kill the kink for me! And then they succeeded. Why are gonna be- I'm going to sing while I- Oh, burn it! Ah! A giant clam! Thanks! Give me some I can put to good use. That's super fab, Sandy! Yeah, I'll train you. It's better spot right here. Love those. I do. Thank you, Bella. Hi there. What do you need? I just want to say hi. I started cleaning my place yesterday, but I'm nowhere close to done. But I did read a bunch of comics, and that's way, way fun. Also, that rhymed. Right. Quickly, we need to go sell some things to make room so that we can give more gifts and do more stuff. Also, Bud's here! Hey, Bud! How's it going, Sandstar? You hit a buff at your home, I'm here to sell you some stuff. Give you things. Really? What is it? I'll tell you what it is. It is... Thing! Can't hand in Bella's photo. I can open it now, I can't wait! A oh, giant clam, huh? Oh, this is great! It'll be perfect for some heavy curls, shredded. Here's something for you! A cute floor lamp, take don't be shy! Thanks, Bud! But you just get some comics. Yeah, You're just ready to go, so uh, what do you need, Shredder? Just want to chat. If you see something you like, you better pounce on it. My wallet's feeling pretty mighty. Mine isn't. 
mine isn't feeling mighty. Okay. We are not going to sell Bella's photo. But we will sell all of these. Make sure we're not selling Bella's photo. We are not. 32k. Thank you very much. Yep, they're starting to sell surfboards and fans and all of the summer things. They'll be selling them all summer. Alright. So. Put away Bella's photo. Then we'll go around and say hi to Becky. If we can. I have that, actually. Uh, it's part of the um, limited run, like, anniversary big Switch collector's box set. It has a reprint of the Doom comic. It's neat. Alright. Let's go and say hi to Becky. I think it's slightly smaller than um, it was originally, but it is a still reprint. Oh, she's cooking. Well, it certainly seems that someone is interested in my culinary prowess, Chicklet. What do you make him? Oh, I'm glad you asked. I'm making some peach pie. It's quite trivial if you have the recipe, Chicklet. How silly me. I could just get, offer you the recipe that you could. Now, if you already know that recipe, you can feel free to share it with someone else. Just tell them you got it from me, won't you? Oh, of course I will. Is there something else you need, Chicklet? Found a pegler relic that would be mad, but it turns out really good. Uh, two, actually. What gives you plus one health when you kill? Oh, that one's really good. Both of them are really good. For me, you shouldn't have. Like, those are really good. They allow you to be a lot more reckless. What a nice driving job. Shame I'm returning you to it right away. Well, look at that. It's a giant clam. Thank you, Sandstar. You're too kind, Chicklet. You know what? I'm going to return the favor. Here, take this. It's a cheek wall! It almost has the word Chicklet in it, but it's only part of it. Did you leave me something, Chicklet? Just want to chat. I've been cleaning and organizing it never before. I tell you, I've been swept up in this decluttering craze. I was tidying up my photos and so many memories came rushing back. I wonder how my friends in these pictures are doing now. Goodness, I hope they haven't forgotten me. Oh, they might have. By the way, I discovered, thanks to a uh, YouTube short, a lovely fact about uh, words. So, uh, homeowner has the word meow in it. And now I can't unknow that. Now, now it's a, it's a hope meowna. Uh, I, that short was just like, yep, yep, that's that's true. Thanks, brain. Now my brain knows this. It'll never not know it. It's just got the word meow in it. Look at that, Eeks. I have an idea. I'm going to try to distract you so you don't get any money from this. Darn it. So I heard from someone else. So you love fantasy more than any of the kind of comics, yes? I do. Guess how much I know about fantasy? Nothing. But that's why we're best friends, Cindy. You know all about fantasy. Yeah, I, I can't get any more money from this now. That's it. So I gotta wait for you to stand up. I've seen Bud. Uh, so Cole. Chops. Lyman. Oops, ran through a flap. Already given you a gift. Cole is not in. Give one to Jitters as well. Maybe Cole will be somewhere around here. Oh! Oh! There is a bag! Alright, whose is this? It is. Erasable bag, it's a tad open. Gym clothes, that could be a lot of people. 
I'm gonna guess, Lyman. It's now two o'clock. But I can't find Lyman to give him it. So instead, I'm gonna guess Bud. It is someone sporty, yes. L let's... Oh, 2 p.m. music's here now. Normalcy has been restored. All right. Is this yours, bud? Is this yours? Hey, oh, said star. Just, just time for some push-up training. Haha, <laughs> just kidding, shredded. Ah, uh, did you drop something? What is it, shredded? Show me. I'd like to show you... Thing. Hmm, this is... Sorry, but this isn't mine. But I've seen Lyman with one of these before, Shredded. Darn it, it is Lyman's. Ah, <sighs> well. Where's Lyman? Oh, no. I need to find Lyman. Hello, Ari. I need to find Lyman. Otherwise... Otherwise, I can't give gifts to anyone else. Well, this is going to be awkward. Alright, we should be alright, though. Roughly. Okay. Put this down here. The search for Lyman. I mean... We're not going to have more than one episode of the search for Lyman, because... We could always just restart the game and have Lyman spawn in that way. He's somewhere on the island. The question is where? Because he's not at home. He's... Not here and Boris isn't there. Oh, found him! Found him! He's right here! Afternoon, Chimps! You're doing good! Got a gift for you. Your thing. What is it, Chimps? Show me! I've got this for you! Ha! Huh, it's... My bag! Wow, I haven't seen that for a while! Thanks for finding it! Oh, I guess... Yeah, here's a little something. It's just a small thank you. Okay, it's a piece of clothing. Whew! Check it out! I'm giving you my extra mattress plate shirt! Good as new! Yeah! He's so happy. Need something, Chips? I've also got this for you. What? For me, Chips? Oh yeah, I've got... Thing! I could've got an extra awesome reward if I'd have given it to him immediately. Haha, <laughs> I wonder what it could be! Oh neat! You seriously got me a giant clam! Oh, this is great! It'll be perfect for some heavy curls, Chips! Time to flex some graduate muscles! I want you to have a pilot's uniform! Thanks, Lyman! No coal yet, or Boris. You're just ready to go, so uh, what do you need, Chips? Just want to say hello? You know, my muscles are big enough to admit that my training hasn't been as effective lately. That's why I decided to turn regular activities into a chance to pump, Chips. Eating, for example. I tried to chew as fast as possible to target my face muscles. The only gain I got from it was an upset tummy and a sore jaw. Back to the drawing board, I guess. Uh, we're not flying anywhere yet. We will be. But we'll be flying as a passenger, not as the pilot. Uh, we are not a trained pilot. Uh, I would not trust myself to fly a plane. Ever. In any capacity. There it is. And I can barely navigate flying in Might and Magic 7. Gonna do that. Also, Dodo is a trained pilot ever. Well, funnily enough, no bird is a trained pilot on account of them being birds. However, this is a fictional universe where birds can, in fact, be trained pilots. So, in this universe, yes, a Dodo can be a trained pilot. That said, that's a very niche thing. Okay, cheese is doing fine. Let, let's double check. Cheese is good! Still need to find Charlie's 
Boris, coal, and wait for chops to stand. Is this his fiction? I... I'm sorry, but, uh, yes. Y yes, it's very not real. I mean, the fact that I'm literally controlling it should tell you that it's not real. Oh, hey, Cole. Hey, dear. Got a gift for you. Huh. What is it? I'll tell you what it is, buddy. It's thing. Specifically, clam. What's inside? I'm gonna look. Oh, need it's a giant clam. Thanks. Cool. What else can I can make with this? Here, said start a Max's dress shirt just for you, cool. Thanks, Cole. Always appreciate it. I'm so sleepy. Anyway, what's going on with you? Just want to say hello. Kix is here visiting. I wonder what cool stuff he's got today. I'm gonna go look later, cool. Now, if you don't mind, I'm gonna grab this bag and I'm just gonna look at trees. I've also found Boris. Okay, found Cole, found Boris, just need to talk to Charlize now. Because Boris is over there. By the way, stick attained. And there's Boris with his own sticks. Hey, how you doing? Got a gift for you, my friend. What, you want to give me something? I do, would you like? Thing? Hey, I wonder what it is. I'm excited to open it. Oh, a giant clam? Oh, I guess you never know what coming hand until you need it, right? I'll gladly take it off your hands. Eat no free, Miss Walt, so as a thank you. Have Morris's photo! Ha ha! Two photos for your buddy. Thanks, my friend. Someone up. It's always great to get more photos from you. What do you think? Don't I look swell in my Zen uniform? Seriously, I'm asking. I have no clue how I look at this kind of... <laughs> Don't worry. You look awesome. You always look awesome, my friend. Right, we need... Okay, Charlie's is in. But before we go talk to Charlie's, I'd like... to see if Chops is standing up. Ball! Didn't mean to use the ball, but I have. He is snazzy. Okay, Chops is somewhere... Where did Chops go? Oh, there he is! What's up, Sandstar? Got a gift for you. Seriously, for me? I, I was quoting the most famous and cool person in the world, Superfly Johnson. What if I'm surprised I don't miss right now? How about that? You got me a giant clam! Gotta love an Arthian gift. Way to coordinate. I can't let you walk away from the head after so generous to me. Hey, you gotta take a bathroom sink, okay? Literally, I, I I brought everything with me, but this is the thing you want. Looking for a obsession with old chaps, eh? Just want a chap? Hey, is that one of those vaulting poles I've been hearing about? Ugh, I want one so much! I don't care about vaulting, I just want to have the latest cool thing! There is an amazing quote from Bella about the stick. Hi! Good to see you again, Eggs! Just want to chat with you. Hey, have you ever been inside Maggie's house before? I love, love, love the decor in there. They could totally stick their advice in magazines. I'd read them. I'm gonna go in my tiny little room and sweep my uh, gun. That's what she do. She get a tiny little broom and she sweep everything up. This is cause she could. Scientists increasingly believe that Bella is good. I, I don't know. I I could agree with that. I think it's correct. Has she found the cello? She has. Okay. Let's just jump over here. Go meet Charlie's. And then go to the Able Sisters. Then empty your inventory in case the produce is ready. Hello. Good to see you, Erg. You're welcome anytime. Glad to hear it. Seriously? You rock. What do you got? Ten out of nine doctors agree that Bella's adorable. That's a, that's an interesting statistic. 
is the 10th one Bella. You don't mind what's on this now, right? A giant clam! Very cool! Thank you, Sandstar! I'm getting to think about how I want to use this. So why is gift exchange? Here, take a toga! I don't know why I've got this. So what want to say, Erg? I just want to say hello. You ever tried to get a present for someone, but you kind of mess it up? This one time I got my friend all hyped up about this big, huge present I got him. See, he told me about how much he loved his kaleidoscope when he was little, so I got him a new one! I was so excited for him, but when he opened the present, he kind of just shook his head. Turns out he had this gigantic kaleidoscope collection. He hung out at his place a million times, I never noticed he even had like 15 of the one I got him. Seriously, how did I not catch that? Well, we still laugh about it. I gra gra graduated where? I, I don't get the statement there. I do, however, get that I'm going into here. Hey there! Welcome to Amos' Most of Fashion Made Lovely by Claw. Thank you! And hello, Sable. It's sort of silly since we're at the shop all day, but sunny weather helps you work faster. Or maybe it's just that I'm making shorter sleeves. We've been having more and more hot weather days lately. Summer's just around the corner. Probably time to get out my collection of summer aprons. It's definitely a, a Greek toga. Thanks, please come again. I will. I'll show you. It's definitely a Greek toga. If I get out the toga... Yeah, it, it's... It's a Greco-Roman style toga. If I went to a graduation with that, I'd uh, have some questions raised, like, who are you and why are you in this graduation area? Greco-Roman. Not Gecko-Roman. Oh dear. Because those two those two um, civilizations very much intermingled. Pardon me there with the sniffle. Alright, let us sell some things to make some room. Oh, don't sell that. Just grab that. This here in preparation for being put away. Oh, also, I think we got uh, selling shells. Nook mile thing. Was it selling shells? Oh, yeah, it was selling shells. Kiko knows his nook mile goals. Actually, uh, I don't think it's the Emperor's Toga. There's not enough knives in it. Yeah. Okay, Margie is looking... Oh, that, 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 that's lovely. Margie is examining this. She's like... That's really lovely. I knew putting that there was a good idea. Just like, huh. <laughs> Wait, did I leave the stove on? D did I leave the stove on? D d d <gasps> I did leave the stove on! I have sometimes done that. I've sometimes thought, hang on, did I? Did I lock the car? Did I lock? The, did I, I? I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I'm checking. I'm checking if I lock the car. Ninety-nine times out of a hundred, I did in fact lock the car. But every once in a while, you forget to lock the car. And then you're like, oh, I did forget. And there's a small part of the back of your mind. Makes you question. At least 
least we're well on schedule for this stream. Like, I'm nearly done with all this stuff. Then we go see Cleo. We go do the, uh... The wedding photos. Nothing over there. Glad I can check in an app if I have locked my car. Ooh. Ooh, I, I would not like that. I personally would not like that at all. I don't know why, but it, it, I just check it all the time. I'm like, hey, is, is my car still locked? Still locked now? I do need to wash the car at some point soon. That is a thing I do need to do. Oh, and there goes the watering can. Is what is my car still where I left it? I mean, if my car's no longer where I left it, um, I don't need to worry about whether it's locked. Like, like, hey, is the car locked anymore? Does it matter? Because it's not there. You say wheat being grabbed by hand is unnatural, but isn't a farming implement technically unnatural? Like, it's a man-made object. We need sickles. Yeah, they're not natural either. They are also man-made. So the natural way to harvest a plant is to pull it by hand. That just goes to show that the level of familiarity we have with technology and man-made implements, like they've been such a integral part of human existence for so long that we can look at not using an implement as unnatural. Isn't the world strange? Well, this truly a strange thing. It is strange, it is beautiful, it is majestic, it is terrifying. And it is home. Like I'm at home right now. In my house, doing house things. Working right now. Worked this morning too. It's been a busy day for me. It's been a busy day. I mean, I don't know where you all are. You you could be anywhere. You could be on the moon. Could be watching me from the International Space Station or the middle of, on a plane journey or anywhere such as the broad accessibility of the internet Here. 
This is where my parents like message me in 20 minutes, going, "We're here," and I'm like, "Great, I am uh, completely not ready." That said, I have told them when roughly I'd be done, so they're likely not to turn up that much before then. Let's go talk to everyone's favorite library slash museum-y based owl. I don't think he's ever in the library. Ooh, ooh, but I can see him, Mum. Oh dear, pardon me. Well, hello, Sandstar. Welcome to the Hillsfire Museum. How may I be of service? Well, I won't tell anyone, MC. I don't even know who you work for. Oh, how would you like me to assess? I'm all of Flutter. I'd like for you to assess all of thing, please. Oh, well, the one I see. Let us take a closer look, shall we? Yes, indeed, they're quite splendid, but alas, our museum already has fossils such as these. I would be tempted to put these in my personal collection, but no, I must exercise your shade, Tumble Tom, too now. Well, thank you very much, brothers. Might I help you with anything else? I'm good. Johnny Good, please enjoy the rest of your visit. I shall. And by that, I mean I'm rushing up to here and seeing if Rossetti's nearby. Palm with the sniffle again. Is Rossetti here? Yes. Oh, Steel Rain, you now have access to uh, a different owl. You have access to uh, a little cab. Well, looky here, you again, we keep up with each other. That we do. Hey, I don't mean to butt in, but give me your devices charged. For safety's sake, got it? Will do. My old enemy, the reset button. Did you know that they're basically obsolete? Ha! Huh? Looks like I won! But now I'm thinking a little older. I'm thinking, what if reset buttons are actually good? Like, if you mess something up real bad, wouldn't it be good to get a do-over? I mean, life needs a reset button! Haha, <laughs> sorry about that, I might have got a bit, had to be too much coffee. Little cap! There's also a bigger cap. There he is! What's hold I did today? Kept some coffee, it's two dollars a cup. Sure thing? Sure. At some point, Cav's gonna try and get me to get a bigger monitor. He'll be like, get this bigger monitor, Kiko! And I'll be like, but big monitors! They'll be like, but you must! I'll brew this cup especially for you. Drink up, cool. Times are a changing, Kiko! And I'm like, no! Change! But I bet I could deal with it. Maybe. Possibly. Perhaps. Oh, wow! The depth of flavor expands at this cooler temperature. That it does. Cool. Thank you very much. No problem. One second. There we go. Sorry about that. I'll say get pushy it hangy, there we go. Okay, with that done, all we have to do now is sell the things that are inventory, go put some money away, invite Cleo over to the campsite, make their item, and then it is time for the wedding items. We are miles ahead of schedule. I don't think a new monitor is a pressing concern, Kiko. I don't know! I could have a third monitor cab, have it sideways. Have it be like chat monitor or something. Cab's like, no, do not get a third. To be fair, if I got a third monitor, where would I put my diploma for Temi? Where would I put my diploma from the International School of Tem? I mean, I could hang it on the walls. I need to find somewhere to hang it. Also, they have sad elephant watering can. It is time to buy three of these. No, it is time to buy four of them. This is a good investment in the future. There is always shovel, but there is not always sad watering can. You can change its appearance, but I, I like sound. What well, fantasizing about third monitor? TV sized 4K monitor to hang above your desk. Sure, let's do it. Why would I want that, Cav? What? Why would I want a massive monitor there? I 
that seems like a really... Why would I want that? Do you not want an earthquake risk? Well, welcome to England, where earthquakes are incredibly rare. I'll do that later. They're incredibly rare and never very powerful because we're in the middle of a tectonic plate. Like, we, we get maybe a tiny, very brief earthquake every number of years. So, never have to worry about earthquakes. He has a stream deck for that. That is true. There is always a tiny little um, cav icon staring at me judgmentally. And I can always put it onto sleep mode so I, th so I can see Void Bill. I tell you, if nothing else, the stream deck is fantastic because it allows me to know. Like right now, I don't need to check my streaming software to know that I'm streaming. There's a little icon here that's like, they're streaming! Or there's a little icon here that says, they're recording! This is Cleo. A pleasure to hear from you. Do you need something? Would I like to go camping in your but nothing would please me more, sugar? In fact, funny story, I was just telling your friend that I wanted to pay your little island a visit. Does that mean it's non-stick? Well, technically, it's floating, so... Yeah, it... it it's not really stuck to anything so much as it's bobbing up and down on, uh, you know, the layer below that's not really super... So it's Tectonics are complicated. The science that makes up the workings of our planet is complicated. Many things are complicated. But you know what's not complicated? That's right, my throne wish list. There you can pledge towards all kinds of things. Mostly Warhammer and Amiibo cards right now that bring me joy. Did you like that segue? I thought it was very subtle. About as subtle as my puns. I heard that segue was terrible. No, I'm not waving. That was a terrible one. I'm so happy to see you. Thank you for inviting me to enjoy your fabulous island, sugar. And there's Cedar raining. Hey, how you doing? To be honest, darling, I wouldn't have thought this camping would suit me like this. I hope your stream went well. After all, I usually loathe to go with our basic amenities, you know, like an infinity pool or a heated bidet. But much to my surprise, roughing it suits you just fine. It finally appeals to my bold nature. No, his horse isn't about a little fresh air and an unkept wilderness keep me from adventure. Seeing how I came all this way, I can't help but think it would be nice to take something home with me. Something unique to impress my friends, perhaps a souvenir to prove I was here. I hope your uh, stream went well, Cedar. I've got it! How about an aroma pot made right here? Well, that's just clay. My word, really? I couldn't possibly say no to such a kind offer. Oh, I can't wait to see your masterpiece. Now I must return home tomorrow. I do hope you can get it back to me today, sugar. The uh, notification is the sound of a dungeon invasion, like a uh, invasion of cavern dwellers from Dwarf Fortress. That's what the sound is. Rat men! Yep, here come off the rat men with their donation of silver. I should see what you have, by the way. Work with champ. Have a look. No rush, no rush at all. What have you got? Um, that's nice. All right. Play the fringe bag. Two thousand four hundred bells. You buying? I'm buying. Very much obliged. Thank you very much. I oh, appreciate your business, my chap. Anything else you want to buy? I'm good. Much obliged. Okay, put this away. And then, get out some clay. I think we only need three clay. I think three will do the trick. As luck would have it, I have three right there. How serendipitous. I love that word, serendipity. It's a nice word. 
Okay, I'm gonna craft up a... A rover pot! For three! Have I been playing this game too much? Do I know all the things? I mean, I know a fair few of them. Also, we just crafted an item. That's the third item for the craft daily. Well, not daily. It's a, it's a not mild challenge. They're not necessarily daily. Some of them are, but many of them repeat. So in theory, you could earn an infinite amount of Nook Miles. Which you could then spend to go to more Nook Mile Islands, which you could then do other stuff, and uh, let the rinse repeat until you've got everything done. Now here we go with our good friend Cleo. How you doing? Ooh, did you finish crafting my fab souvenir? Be a dear and don't drag me out. Tell me, sugar. Here's ready. No, no, you, you don't, don't rinse blathers. You won't appreciate that. Ah, yet another Hills Farm masterpiece to add to my collection. Of course, this piece will be given a pride of prominence in my collection. It deserves nothing less. Another job well done, my dear. You really must accept a foosball table for all your troubles. I don't even know why I brought this with me. This souvenir is lovely, but what's even more lovely is the generosity I experienced here. I can only hope I'll have another opportunity to visit this island. Do invite me to camp here again. Perhaps I'll truly understand what it is that makes this place so special, sugar. I'm sure you will. I want you to know the aroma pot you made for me. Why, it's proof you have excellent taste. Don't you dare let anyone tell you otherwise, sugar. Yep, yep. I have excellent taste in fashion and everything else, clearly. You know, everyone in this island is really incredibly nice. Still, I can't help but wonder, would it be so nice to me if I lived here for good? Why not find out? Oh my, there is something to be said for diving right in, but I should get to know me island better first. I feel I need a few more visits that I'll know for sure, so invite me to camp here again, won't you? Could I be falling in love with this little island? It just might be sugar. Well. Interestingly, I think instead of it just might be, it should be I just might be. There are a few instances where the grammar is a little bit spotty, and that is one of them. I think it should be, I just might be, rather than it just might be. I, I read that, because that's what is written there, but I always go, shouldn't it be I, rather than it? I don't know. But what I do know is we are now going to be showing up as the most amazing and fantastic of, uh, hello, Budgie, of, uh, fashion designers right now. It's time. We are going to be passionate about fashion. And wedding design. Hey, hey, well, to one to get away in the skies, there, Hills for Airport. How can I be out today? I would like to fly. Roger! So, just to get the paper gold fishing, where do you want to go? I want to go to Hobbs Island, please. Hobbs Island? Roger that, good buddy. I can set you up right now, but are you ready? I'll pack the stuff. I totally am. Let's go. All right, let's get you airborne. Do the one. This is Dodo Town. Will be your copy. Got to walk on these wings. Over. Roger, ready when you are. Okay, have a good flight, friend. And when you need to travel, just think, what would Dodos do? Let us go do my wedding stuff. Yeah. Don't worry. I will make the best wedding place ever. It will be full of awesome. Touch not like watching movies in a con swamp. We're parked and proud. That still made no sense. Give a quack to wing back. Hi, buddy. Hey, it's Handstar. Good to see you. So, uh, get to do my anniversary photos of recent Cyrus? So you got a question about the suit? Let's do those those photos. Right on. Give me half a second to get my kitchen, I mean my wedding set ready. Hold tight. Here we go! Hello! I have a plan for this one, you're gonna like it. Oh, thank you so much for coming back to work with us on another set of photos, sad stuff. I can't wait to see how this one turns out. So today I think we should have a ceremony photo in a place that looks like a wedding chapel. It'll be just like a real ceremony, professing our love for each other in front of everyone. So romantic. What we're looking for is a cute set with plenty of pink and white. Preferably using a lot of furniture my side guy made. When you're all done with the set, we've got a few photos in the can. Come talk to us, okay? Thanks. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. 
Hang on. Oh, I know what we can do! <sighs> I have a plan. Just, uh, do 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 do. Gotta get an amiibo. Come on. Wait. Oh, I can't add anyone. Boo! It's okay. There'll be one where we can. And it'll be the bestest. Now, they want... They want a wedding scenario. Okay. So, when I think of weddings... I think of cake. I think of cake. I think of delicious, lovely cake. Just a little bit of cake! Just a bit of cake! You know! Just, just a tad. Hey, this is exactly how much cake they had in their wedding. They, they will tell you as such in a moment, okay? Trust me. They will tell you as such. Okay, if we do that... Oh, we are out of space! Okay. We literally cannot put any more items. But it's okay. We got a good picture in mind here. Okay. I do that. And then... Oh, no, not that one. Just gotta just make myself vanish. Yeah, just, just a little bit of cake. Oh, hang on. I, I can't actually reach there. And there we go. This is exactly how they remember their wedding, alright? Who knew all that rogue stealth training would be applied to wedding photography? Exactly! Hello, g -Bolt. Oh, the last one seemed nice. Mind if I take a quick peek? Did you take more than one? I'll just look at my last one if that's okay. Let me have a look at what you think. Great, now let's see. Oh, my goodness. It's everything I could have wanted. You've somehow captured all the joy and love in my darling and I share one amazing photo. I love it. There's so much cake. How are we going to refrigerate all this? So much cake. This costs literally thousands and thousands and thousands of bells. All the cake! We're gonna go bankrupt. Anyway, I have a little something to show appreciation. I hope you like it. My psycho ready just for you. It's a wedding flower stand! It's not cake. That's all mine. And, because I'm just full of surprises, I have something, some heart crystals for you. Thank you. Well, that was so much fun and we made another great photo! We did! Great photo! I hope you'll come back tomorrow for another shoot. Who's going to eat all the cake? There's only three of you. Three? You mean two? Also, I, 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 I'm pretty sure that um, Harvey will help out. And Harriet. Yeah. Now, what's your art like today? Fake and... Hang on, is that one real? It is real! I won't lie, an awful lot of folks have been asking me about buying that serene painting there. But maybe the price scared them off, so... I'll tell you 4,980 bells. Deal with the summer, you win. Uh, yes! 
Ha! Huh, you are not gonna regret this. I'll just take those bells from you. Here is all that. Congratulations, you're now the proud owner of a serene painting. But if I too busy with your cousin, I'll get you all packed up and shipped out tomorrow. No problem. And there they are. Well, 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 you're looking surprised, and stir what you need. I just want to put some stuff away, please. In the use you need? Nope, I'm good. Yep, you so sprout. <laughs> Can I have a larger part in this game? No. I am the one that is in charge of this island, but I could, like, tell you to turn on a lighthouse or something. No? Alright, then, friend. And now, we go find a skeleton. How are you, long time no speak? I just thought I'd let you know uh, that I was in Uber yesterday and my driver was called Kiko. Not only did I realize that you drove Uber as well as streaming, that you're also a... Nope, uh, that is not me. Streamwreck shaved eyes is what Tango Kung Fu is go. Do you require assistance over? I'm ready to go home. You want to must sponsor butters about to march to I do. Roger, let's pack snacks and make tracks. And there is somebody in the chat who can actually confirm that that is not me. Yeah, that's the reference. That is the reference, Steel Rain. But, uh... There was someone in the chat who can 100% confirm that I am not that person. Because rest... Margie... Oh, Sandy! You won't believe what I just realized that I did! I was out in the store and I bought something that was on my list! Thing is, when I got home, I realized I just bought the exact same thing yesterday! Wait! Would you be willing to buy my extra jester's cap? Sure! Oh! Thank you so much! Does 2470 bells sound fair? Because you want me to buy it? Of course it is. Thank you very much! Yeah, the Kitty Hawk was not the name of the plane. It was just where they, they flew it, yeah. You made sure that it won't go to waste. Thank you, Tootie. No problem. I'm gonna put that away. I don't remember what they called the plane. I do know they're from North Car uh, they were in North Carolina. I do remember that. Alright, let us go find ourselves a scallop. That is unlikely to be a scallop. Watch it be a scallop. It's alright. Considering the fact that it was well over a hundred years ago, it's understandable that some things get mixed up. You weren't alive at the time. Or were you? I mean, you're small, but I'm not sure you're that small. Not quite 121 years ago yet. Yeah, there is nobody on this earth that we know of right now that is a hundred and... That is a hundred and twenty-one years old. Maybe they're a time traveler. That still wouldn't make them that old, though. Yeah, so they are not old enough to have been alive at that time. So we have no... We have nobody alive. There hasn't been anyone alive actually for a while that uh, was alive when Queen Victoria was alive. Because even that guy was a number of years off. Watch me find a scallop just immediately. Of course. Of course, game. Of course we found a scallop just 
immediately. Hey man, about that scout of yours, can I have it? Sure. Whoa, thanks for generosity, man. I've learned something today. I, I thought it wasn't known as the Kitty Hawk. Since we're cool, I've just something you'll dig. Why don't I have a low lace of truth on you, the deep guy? Feel this. Magic's just science with your eyes closed, man. Think you, that you skilled let it simmer. Yep, today's a good day. That is a statement! It's a deep thought. Then we'll have time for more Boris Wisdom. This is true. We do, in fact, have time for more Boris Wisdom. Actually, uh, throw away this and that. Yeah, but let's, let's go with the fact that, as far as we know, no one can time travel. Also, how would we verify that a time traveller is in fact that old? They could just say they're whatever age they like. Like someone could go, I'm actually from the year 3829 and I'm 502. Okay, prove it. And then you'd be like, uh... I can't prove that I'm 502. Because I have the body biologically of a 32 year old. And it's like, yeah. So for all we know, you're about 30. We don't actually know how old you are. Uh oh. Oh no! Chops down! He is slept. There is Sleepy Chops. Ah, he'll be fine. I find that they tend to recover. It's now a thing of the past. Is it? Or is it a thing of the future that becomes the... Uh? Time travel is confusing. And that's just it in fiction! I'm just gonna wait here, by the way. It's a great way to spend some time. I might also, uh, as a note, end the stream slightly earlier than I normally do in terms of time, just so that I make sure I'm absolutely ready for when my parents are here. <gasps> well, back to reading. No one ever saw that that happened. Early yet to strip? Panic? I mean, it would only be a little early. It's just, a, as I say, my parents are coming around at some point, and I need to make sure I'm ready for them. Yeah, it's exciting, daunting as well. It's many things. Here's Boris. I feel like coming out soaking it in. Seemed as good a spot as any, Snort. They come with a car full of things that are mine. That I'm going to spend a fun evening organizing. What are you looking at, B? You going to behave? <laughs> Sum it up. Let's chat three times, buddy. Your comedian's outfit is... Just plain splendiferous! Yowza! I couldn't pull off that look, but you're rocking it, Snort! Hey, what can I do for you? Let's chat a few more times. Never get up running on a new hobby and just lose the day? Lately I've had this thing for peeling shallots, just one after another. I just love working around that crinkly outer layer to get at the crispness inside. I like to charge myself to see how many I can do before those pesky onion tears get to rolling. I'm up to 55, Snort! ha 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 ha! Oh, hey, kiddo, what do you mind? Sounded like you were smacking every last lock on Bucky Island with your shovel yesterday, Snort. Ain't there some less noisy way to chip yourself off them bits of rock for your DIY projects and whatnot? Nope. Sum it up. Two more chats. We'll do two more. 
In case you heard the story going around that I unearthed an amazing buried treasure, Sandy. Uh, the truth is I managed to take up some old marbles from when I was just a kiddo, short. Funny how me being excited about finding some old toys turned to a tale of forgotten treasure. Hey, what's up? Oh, much help. Hey, this got out of the bloom. How do you feel about giving me a tour of your place? Nothing fancy, just thought it'd be interesting to see how you got things set up and all. Sure! That's my Sandy! So when do you want me to come over, Snort? Right now! Let's scramble on over to your place then, Snort. I mean, sure, why not? You could hang out here for a bit. Give me rather Elton John vibes today? Thank you, I, I went with Sparkly and it just kind of became this. Boris gives you Boris vibes, true! Sorry for barging in, kiddo. I'm just full of mustard today, Snort. I like mustard. Oh, before I forget, I bought you something. Don't get too excited. Just a little excited. Ha 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 ha! Oh, it's food! Don't try to be all fancy by turning down my gift. Who doesn't want a peach? Someone who doesn't like peach? Don't pay attention to the bookshelf. Alright, give me one second, everyone. I'll be right back. I'll let Boris get comfortable. I don't know what he's gonna do. It's exciting! I, I see parties are happening, but not only that, we also have Boris grooving on down here. Let him go! Like, yeah! Look at me! Boogie on down! Oh, I'm done. If you furnish this antique, then that probably means whoever owned it is long gone. Ever wonder who owned your antique console table? Maybe it was someone famous! Maybe it was? So you go for the Zen style, huh? Didn't figure for the quiet meditation store, but good for you. I mean, I approve of Zen. Well, what should we do? Maybe play some kind of game? What do you think? I mean, why not? Alright, you gotta play as a game of high card, low card. We're gonna test your luck a little bit. Okay, if you guess right, I'll give you a sailor's tea. Let's get the show on the road. I'll go ahead and pull the first card. That there's the five. Now I'll just draw the next card. Yeah, I got the card all picked out. So what do you think? Higher or lower than five? <laughs> it used to be Zen. We don't talk about those dark times. Okay! It's equal chances that it's gonna be higher or lower. Equal chances. I'm gonna go with higher. Let's take a look-see. Oh no, it's two! Alright, can all count with them all. Don't get cross, there'll be other rounds, Snort. I'm not cross. Oh, look at you. You got your mom's embroidery in your room. I'll let you in on a little secret. I'm a sentimental pig myself, kiddo. I'm very cross. It's like, yeah! That is the paper tiger that Cabalion got me. I, I still have it up there. Very important to me. Ooh. Can they ever show you a 1 or a 9? Uh, no. Uh, when it's the first card, it's anything from 2 to 8. Because if there was only higher or lower, it wouldn't be much of a game. I know, statistically, that's not how that works, but... They do that for, like, to make it a challenge. Well, where's he going? Is he gonna go dance? Or is he gonna sit?
he sits. Not on the butt rug, I might add. Not on the butt rug, but he does sit. He's just chilling and taking it easy. Look at you, you're quite a collector of rare pieces, Snort. I used to collect plenty of things myself, but I got tired of moving them around. Watch out for that. Whoa, you like music? I like it too! Last thing I do most days is listen to some music to try and relax. When well, you got a temperament like mine, lots of stuff around your album. So, let's listen to tunes and unwind! Alright, uh, you want to listen to tunes? Well done. Yeah, look at you go! I listen to the video game music a lot, atmospheric music, lots of things that don't have singing. Lots of things that generally don't have singing. Aw, uh, Snort, wh why are you still dancing? I, I stopped dancing a while ago, buddy. Ah, well, it, it's what he do. Well, just gonna uh, sit here for a bit. Just enjoy myself. Whoa, where'd you get your worthy painting? Well, I'll be the first to admit I don't know why from a glasses case, but I like it, Snort. I was blocking him from leaving. Look at you, you're quite a collector of rare pieces. Well, I've already mentioned this, but, uh... Where's the unworthy painting? Well, I didn't hang it up, did I? It wasn't worthy. Having all these years already ought to familiarize yourself with a dull model plane. An old buddy used to say that once you get started, they're the greatest thing in the world, Stuart. Seeing as how I've done a little else than, <laughs> than pays a month since getting here, I reckon I was as good a time as any. I mean, it's just a model of a plane. That, by the way, is the color of the plane in your... on your island. What color your airport, and thus the plane is, is determined when the island is gened. And cannot be changed. There is no way to change what color it is. There's no way to change the color. Well, I'm just gonna walk around and definitely not search for anything. Th that's not what I do. I'm not searching. Don't mind me, buddy. That's why my plane is orange. Yep, your plane is orange because that's how it was at uh, Island Gen. And it will stay that color. It will never change. It will always be orange. And what your native fruit is as well and the position of your plaza and other such things never changes. Never changes. <laughs> yep. Fancy music. <laughs> Sorry about that, a little sniffle. My nose is very sniffly today. I think it's just the summer stuff getting to me. Ah. <sighs> It's just nice to relax. Plane, plane never changes. Also, go your phone box. Yeah, a lot of those things, however, you can now change. Like, you can now take those to recent Cyrus, and they'll be able to change those for you. But what ones you start with? Yes. Now we just dancing. He's just enjoying his time, is, is my good friend. Oh, why turn that off? I ain't sure what it is, but there's something about this room that just speaks to me, Snort. Don't be surprised if I nab a notion or two for myself, kiddo. Ha 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 ha! Look at him go. It's just so happy. It's probably the normal room, Boris. It speaks to us all. I'm gonna wiggle all over your room, Snort! Yep. That's what he's gonna do. Hey, Grimmeth, how you doing? Whoa! 
we, we just sort of did the latter part of the stream, just uh, chilling out, unwinded. Boris is just playing all my instruments. It's stereo, Boris. That's what's speaking. As my entire chat last Friday in my stream were going, go to the, the tunnels to Nyon! And I'm like, no! But I probably have to now because I need to get Master Dagger training. I, I probably have to try. It's gonna be pain. Actually, no, some people told you to go to Eiffel. Yeah, they... Yes, yeah, some people told me to go there. That's a bad idea. We are not going there. No, uh, ask yourself, is Master Dagger really worth the trip? I mean... Winning at Arkham Ages? G gotta win that Arkham Age tournament. I like the fact that to get him to go, I have to leave and then immediately pop back in. Wait a minute! You got somewhere else, somewhere else to do, Snort? I do! It's called finishing the stream. Well, well, I suppose I will stay my welcome. It's been fun, kiddo! Yeah, but Arkham Age win doesn't matter until... the choice. I mean... Yes! But getting all those wins in is still good anyway. Remember, I can't town portal anywhere, and I've got no Lloyd's Beacon, so going to a place like Nyon is a decision. It's a decision that takes a lot of investment in time. You know, other thing takes a lot of investment in time. That's right, I know I'm ending a little early, but it's Nyon, but it is. It is. You are, you are not wrong. You are not wrong. I am ending a little early, I know, but as I said, parents are coming around and I do need to get ready for that. I do apologize, but we did get everything done today. Gave gifts to everyone, saw Cleo, made another amazing wedding photo. Cleo and I will be such an undertaker without outdoor spells. I bet I could still do it. I'm gonna have to. I got rid of harpies, I could deal with Nyon. Possibly. Think of the XP! But you know what time it is though, folks? That's right! It's time for me to thank you all for being here. Because you're all absolutely fantastic and amazing and brilliant and wonderful, and I couldn't do what I do without you, and I wouldn't want to do what I do without you. You are the heart and soul of my community. You make all what I do possible, and I have never been happier than when I am entertaining all of you. Because you are truly wonderful. I do apologize, it's a little sooner than anticipated, we did start earlier, but... It's a thing I've got to do to make sure the stream happens. I'm sure you understand. There are a couple of things I need to quickly talk about though before we conclude. Starting off with my website, kakoska.com. Check out all kinds of things there, including my schedule, we've plenty of dust log. You can also find links away compare for Garrett Hope. There's also my Discord. There you can join a large and thriving community, which I'm often a part of. There's loads of places to talk about stuff, loads of remotes, based on let's suppose the streams past and present. If you link your Twitch and Discord together, you're subject to your Twitch, you can use the Twitch and Muscle Discord, which is fantastic. You know what else is fantastic? My Patreon. There you can pledge to support me in doing what I do. There's something let's play a stream wise hidden behind paywalls, but there's a lot of stuff that goes on behind the scenes you typically don't see. Buy more of this book! Good plan. No problem there, MC. Uh, including but not limited to all the editing, compression, and testing, and test recording, because everything makes all what I do a reality. And in these times, especially with the mortgage, I rely on the people that pledge to me to make all what I do a reality. And that is not all. Those that do pledge not only get a different color name on Discord and my deep and sincere thanks, you also get the ability to put suggestions forward for the Patreon shortlisted votes. Then, there are my YouTube channels. There is Kikoskia, my 10,000 video plus and 16 and a half year old Let's Play channel. I'm so old. And then there's King Vodskia, my newer VOD focus channel, which tomorrow will have the first VOD of my playthrough of Daikatana. Because I promised you all that, and we started playing it yesterday, and that was an experience. And both channels like the appeasement of the algorithm, which involves liking, commenting on both videos, on both channels rather, and subbing if you're not. And if you also press that bell for those notifications, actually it wasn't as bad as uh, I thought it would be different. It still had its moments. No problem, my steel. Then there's my Twitter, and my Mastodon, Instagram, Blue Sky, the 
Discord and the community tab on YouTube. There you can follow me to get notifications on when I start streaming and my Let's Play videos go live and all kinds of random other stuff. That's not all though! There's also, it's alright, the vault will be going up tomorrow. There is my throne wishlist as well, where you can put money on all of the, uh, put money towards all the things that are up there that bring me joy. There's Warhammer and some uh, stuff right there. It's, it's weird. That's what it is different. It's weird. Finally, there is me thanking all of you, because seriously, you are all absolutely fantastic and amazing and brilliant and wonderful, and I could not do what I do without you, and I wouldn't want to do what I do without you. You are the heart and soul of my community. You do make all what I do possible, and I have never been happier than when I am entertaining all of you. Truly, you are just amazing and so kind and generous and supportive, and I make my content for all of you, and that you still enjoy it is just such a joy. It truly is such a joy. And with your continued support, I'll be able to keep doing this for many, many years to come, as many years as is possible. So thank you all, folks, ever so much. Seriously, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. And whether it be morning, afternoon, or evening, I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day, and I hope you achieve everything you set up to do. The next stream is tomorrow, as normal. 7 p.m. BST. If we have no heart, no soul. <gasps> Don't tell people that. That's a secret you're letting out. But, uh... 7 p.m. BST, more Mega Man Legacy Collection. We'll be finishing off Mega Man 4, and then we will be going on to 5. It's the first time we haven't started a new game at the start of a stream, but uh, Mega Man 4 was a bit of a doozy. The Cossack Fortress. Dr. Cossack's Fortress was a thing. It was. And I'll catch you next time, folks. And I'll see you then. Later. And remember, be nice to each other, everyone, for if everyone is nice to each other, the world would be that much better a place. And we all want that, don't we? Well, I certainly do. And I hope you do too. Later. Now I rush to get ready for my parents being here! Yay! There was panic. There was panic.